Okay, wasn't expecting a trailer, so I will take this as a win. Kafka, Stellaron Hunter. Okay. How do you plead? Hmm. Oh, she got caught? The crimes you have committed are beyond pardon, but the Chapella Brotherhood respects every individual's entitlement to the afterlife. You can see the buildings flaming in the background. Your punishment. Uh, I'm listening. <laughs> She's... Animal people! You breached the premises of the Atuin Universal Auction, manipulated the guests, oh. decimated the artistic treasures under the gaze of the devout audience, inflicted monetary damage amounting to over 860 billion credits, and absconded with the auction items. How do you plead? Guilty as charged. Hey. A devout audience. You infiltrated the cyber prison of Inupis, stole the Sigma Rod to deactivate the firewall, allowing a flood of data demons to enter reality. Data demons. The world towards a judgment day, all in order to take the meta code. How do you plead? Ha! Huh. I admit it, but those data demons deserve the taste of freedom. You violated the ring world Golconda, disseminated the philosopher's poison virus across all colonies, causing 46 million inorganic entities to turn into rampant machines, and stole the steel core from Golconda's point of gravitational equilibrium. The so hell is... <laughs> How do you plead? Oh? Sounds like a page out of the Japella Brotherhood's playbook. But sure, we took the thing. The Trovis disappearance. The Law 51 Stellaron event. Cyber attacks against planet Skrulum. The Beerpoint incursion. And so on. A total of 46 criminal cases. Do you admit all these malicious incidents were the work of the Stellaron hunters? <laughs> if you ask me, it seems like the Annihilation Gang has their fingers in quite a few of these pies. But I confess, it seems you forgot one, though. The Japella Rebellion. Oh, you're making an incident now? Hell yeah! Oh, this is fun. Nice. This is big Makima from um, <laughs> Chainsaw Man Energy when it came to that shot just then. Same outfit and everything. Oh, are you Sam? They did say that he was a robot. Oh, hi, Blood. Hell yeah, the cat. It's already too late. And then there's, oh, they actually show it. <laughs> Silver Wolf with a gun. Fair. Hell yeah, that was awesome. Ah, oh, that's so cool. But yeah, this is a big cat <laughs> Makima energy from Chainsaw Man. Jesus. So, why did she allow herself to be caught for the purpose of messing with these four to cause the rebellion? Or was this just she unintentionally got caught? Since there was a purpose behind her getting caught by us as well. So I could highly believe this was intentional since Elio seems to be all predicting in his clairvoyance. I, I'm just going to say clairvoyance for the sake of this. It's like his predictions always seem to happen and have a lot of information relative to it like he will tell information so far as how it impacts the future that's going to happen not he doesn't know absolutely every detail but he knows the important ones that lead up to it and what does end up happening i love the aesthetic of this entire trip like they're so good with making these now it's great the aesthetic of this is just pfft. hiding our eyes there but they were present otherwise the annihilation their fingers in quite a few of these seems like the annihilation gang has their fingers in quite a few of these pies so what the hell is that? Is th oh no, that'd be Sam then. If this is Sam, then that was Sam through the window because of the shoulder blades. 
But yeah, Sam's been implied to not be human before, so that's why I assume it's him. Awesome. The cat, the... And that cat's been visible before. We saw it in um, Kafka's um, artwork. Her um, splash art. It has the cat in it. It has those two in it as well. We don't see Sam in the art, so it's neat. I wonder if those are symbolic or if they're meant to be there because crows slash ravens were present in the artwork too. I wonder if there's any other members aside from these Thor and Elio that we know about. There's no way Elio is the cat. It'd be funny as hell. But I imagine he's symbolic. Unless it really is literal, then it'd be funny as hell. I mean, you know, there's a range of things out there in the galaxy. It is actually possible, which is very funny. <laughs> 